welcome back. We are going to start boxing challenge. I think this is the end of chapter two, if I'm correct. So how do I do it, Pete? Do what? Beat those rich kids into submission. Well, what have you tried so far? Random violence, widespread destruction, gratuitous sadism. No, no, that's not gonna work. They get all that kind of stuff at home. Now what you gotta do is you gotta beat one of them publicly. You gotta prove to them you're better than their best man. Why don't you box that dumb jerk Biff? Not bad, Pete. Not bad at all. All right. See you around. Wait, Jimmy, can I come too? <laughs> you know what? Don't worry about it. <laughs> okay, yeah, what's cool? Oh, wow, it's no way. Am I dead? Oh yeah, cause chapter three and four is in winter. Your mom. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> I'm lucky. You and me, Biff. You and me what? You and me, the noble art of boxing. May the best man win. And then you little trust fund fairies will know what life is all about. Anytime, Popper. Of course, the best man always wins. Me. Come on. Afterwards, you can clean my shoes. Okay. His left eye looks swollen. Knock him unconscious. Knock him unconscious. Hopkins is surprisingly tough. <laughs> That's the best you can do. I could do so much better, you know. Be glad I don't enter the fray. Be glad I don't enter the fray. Hopkins, you're pathetic! Okay. I almost have this done. I love watching a good match. I can do so much better, you know. Hopkins is surprisingly tough. Yeah. Me, the champion number one. I killed the best. I will beat the rest. Yeah. What have we got problem. here? That That's poor right. kid just beat yeah. up Biff. He's our new it. champion. He's what? He is That's the right. new champion. Yeah, come on. Come on, man. Woo! You disgust me. <sighs> it takes more than victory to become a champion. It takes breeding and nepotism and snobbery. Filthy Democrat! <laughs> Gentlemen, are we going to let some gutter snipe come in and beat up our friend Biff? No! Then what are we going to do? Beat him back to the ghetto! Yeah! 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 yeah. yeah. You guys soften him up. I'll get him one their time. <laughs> Oh, are you crying? Expensive training. I'm an excellent boxer, you know. Get it. 
You pathetic wretch, hiding behind your friends. I'm leveraging the assets I have, and you don't. Friends. Just shut up, Darby. Here's some more tactics for you, poor boy. Just what I was looking for. Locking you are the door. Not bad for an ill-bred moron like you. God puts me here. I oh wait, I got a slingshot. Why am I not? You guys so soften him up. I'll get him. Get him. What if the others find out? Really? Assets I have, and you don't. Friends. Just shut up, Darby. Here's some more tactics for you. Poor boy. Get out of the food. Out of here. Locking the door. Not bad for an ill-bred moron. You Just run away. Just run away. This ain't fair. We can vote. You are messing with the wrong chap. My God! Get out of here! I have had enough of this. You're gonna regret this. Kids, who's uh, the boss now, my waspy little friend? Uh, Answer the question. You are louder. You are. Uh, that's right, me. Now 
Now you girls, learn to play nice, you understand? <laughs> a pop away. Yeah, two trophies in a while, way on two quizzes. Okay. Now, Darby is really stupid, malevolent, and rich. So it will surprise none of you to discover in a future life, he'll end up in Congress. But this is my story, not his. With the trust fund babies under control, it's time to turn my attention to their sworn enemies, those greaseball kids. <sighs> so, you must be pretty proud of yourself. You taught those rich scum a lesson? They're rich, weak bullies. It was easy. They picked a fight with me, and I showed them who was boss. And Gary got them to pick that fight, so maybe you'll show him as well. Gary's an even bigger problem. He'll have to wait. Hey! What's this throwback want? A haircut? A nice strong man to cuddle up to? Who knows? Jimmy Hopkins, right? My friend Johnny needs your help. Then tell your friend Johnny to come and ask for it. Nobody tells Johnny anything. Johnny Vincent does the telling. Well, he doesn't tell me what to do. Now beat it, greaseball. You're causing an oil slick. I said he needs your help, man. Do I look like a charity service? You're gonna pay for this. What is wrong with this place? Everyone here either needs help, wants to beat you up, or both. Well, you know who Johnny Vincent is, though, don't you? No, and I don't care. He's head of the greaser clique. Get friendly with him, and he could help you get to Gary. Yeah, maybe. Tell you something, Pete. This place blows. Tell me about it. <laughs> Okay, yeah, we are going to do uh, at least probably two more missions in this chapter. Why is my <laughs> underwear all... That's funny. <laughs> yeah, let's go do two more missions. And then, and this part, it's interfaith, but I don't. Uh, Joe, it's Johnny. Cook's quest. Uh, yeah, we're going to do Joe, it's Johnny. <laughs> Okay. Uh. Actually, uh. let's go get a bike. Then we're gonna do Jarvis Johnny. Okay. Those pants are kind of. <laughs> That's my ride, loser. Wow. Okay. So you came? Yup. I bet you think I'm funny, don't you? A laughing stock? Not really. I mean, you dress a little weird, but... Yeah, and everyone is laughing at me. All of you, at me! What are you talking about? Don't play dumb with me. Have you had her? Who are you talking about? I bet you have. Have you had what her? What are you doing? Who? Lola! That slut! That slut I love. No, man! She's cheating on me, man. I know she is. The little slut. It's killing me. Me, dying over abroad. Oh, man, I knew this was coming. <laughs> what are you talking about? She's with that rich kid, Gord. I know she is. How do you know? Will you find out for me? I can't take the suspense. Look, meet me at the underpass near New Coventry tonight. We'll get evidence. Bring a camera, and then we'll settle this. Once and for all.
Hope someone's taking notes for you. You're such a bad boy. <laughs> ah, you ain't nothing. Oh my god. <laughs> Look, that creep's been following us. Who's that guy that keeps following us? Leave me alone! Did you ever hang out with a girl like me before? Uh, me? Stupid cop! How about you leave me alone? But poor trash, and that's what you'll always be. My life else to for you? That's kind of pointy. I don't think my daddy would approve. You really should be in school. Is it Halloween or something? Look at you. Shouldn't you be collecting food stamps or something? Shouldn't you be leaving people? Oh my god! Why hate? For me? Oh, thank you. Damn it! Stop holding hands, I only think that would upset me. I said slugger, those light hands strike twice in the same place. They're not giving us both the job. Yeah, yeah, sure. That shirt ain't doing anything for you. Your bum friend give you the shirt off his back. Okay, now after all of that was good. Okay. Go back to Johnny. Here are the pictures, Johnny. Lola's a bit of a slut. Oh, I it seems. knew it. I just knew it. Sorted. Okay, yeah, with uh, with nerd challenge bait. Okay, yeah, we're going. We are going to do the cups. What's? But what's? I really but what's chainsaw clothes? Uh.
Okay, we start to look at the cross and then end this episode. Well, maybe do chemistry part four. The chemistry four is that. Part four, got it. Same boy. Two, don't want. No. Help your fellow Bullworth Academy. How about no? Cooks <laughs> crush. Who's the lucky guy? Dr. Watt! The chemistry teacher? Uh-huh. I don't know what it is about that guy, but every time I get a look at his bald head and manic eyes, I go all gooey inside. Okay, that's enough information. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Love is blind. I sure hope so. Hey, kid, I need you to do me a favor. <laughs> Dr. Watts doesn't actually realize that we're going on a date yet. <laughs> but we are. <laughs> and I need to get ready. So, can you get me Ms. Phillips' perfume from the staff room? You know where that is, right? Oh, and I almost forgot. Some candy and some sedatives. And for the sedatives, don't buy them. Just look for them in the trash. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I can do that. Good. <sighs> Got you. Them up real. Real and laugh, robbing the brain, you understand. Class is about to start! I must regain the golden tongue. How else can you see? You should be in class now! They're out <gasps> to get me. I'm sure of it. All the signs are there. I'm afraid that my instruction is mostly incomprehensible to the students. I'm sure that with the proper research, chemistry can solve the problem. Why would Mr. Hatrick... You lout! You should not have done that! I can use that. Some candy, but you'll have world. to pay for it. A little something. It's what you wanted, right? Why aren't you in class? What else could you possibly want to be doing? Thank <laughs> you. 
Edna, I got your stuff. Hey, Edna, you old bat. I got your stuff. Oh, oh God. Fantastic. If I was 50 years older, I'd date you myself. Ah, thanks, kid. Where's the perfume? Right here. Okay, then. Oh, thanks. I needed that. I get so nervous before a date. Yeah, well, Who good doesn't? luck, Edna. <laughs> hey, kid, wait! I need you to do me a favor. Another one? Yeah. What's in it for me? Ha! I won't spit in your food. Will you spit in Mr. Hattricks if I say yes? <laughs> for you, kid, I'll do worse than spit. Okay. <laughs> what do you want? I want to go on a nice date with Dr. Watt. So go then. Have fun. Yeah. Well, you know what you kids are like. You see a beautiful couple out on a date, and you're bound to do anything to ruin it. You got a point. So listen. I need you to watch out for me and keep those disgusting kids away. Well, that was a good part. Job well done. I oh, like, you know, oh, 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 subscribe. <laughs> I was trying I get to get five of it. Comment how your family day weekend's going and oh, I'm crazy going gaming. And don't forget to never stop gaming. And shout out your friends. If you feel like it. So see you in the next one.